Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube video. Today I'm just going to be sharing with you guys how I did this makeup, looking very natural, and then a couple of items I picked up from Shein. That's right, Shein. <laughs> okay, if you're interested, continue to watch. Anyways, let's go. It is absolutely crazy to me what eyebrows will do for you. I feel like I can't even film without eyebrows. <laughs> I got the MAC Spiked Eyebrow Styler. Um, so the color is spiked. I've actually never used a pencil like this. I used an eyeshadow. It took me like 10 times longer just to do these, but I like it. I feel like it needs some work, but we look more natural. So, cute. You guys have no idea. I've been waiting for like a week just to show you guys this because I didn't have time to film. And trust me, I am excited. So, next we start with foundation. I guess I should just show you guys what I got first. Okay, so I got the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I got the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer. And I got a lip pencil. What color is this? The color is Spice. I still haven't opened this. This is from Charlotte Til <laughs> That would happen. Oh, I need scissors. You have no idea. I wanted to do my makeup all week and with these products, but they kind of slowly started to come. Now they're here. Get to choose like two sample products when you order. I think it's if you spend an X amount of money, but I got the Charlotte's Magic Serum. We'll see if that's good. See if she's worth buying. And then push up black lashes. It's like a lash lift effect. That's cool. We'll try that out. Oh my gosh. Okay. Pillow Talk Diamonds Glossy Star Lip Color. In Lucky Diamond. This is Airbrush Flawless Finish Complexion Perfection Micro Powder. So I think I got two powders. It appears so. Look how cute that is. I got it a small size because I really don't know if the full if I like this. But this is just to kind of blend everything, I guess, or get your T-zone. And then I got foundation, uh, flawless filter. Let me show you guys. I got the shade 5.5 tan. And we got the contour one, easy contour. I will try to open this one. Looks easier. Oh my gosh, I forgot about these. So I saw these on TikTok, which is why I purchased them. But they're like a cream contour blending wand. So, oh my gosh. Oh, how do you open that? Do you push down? Do you just twist? Okay, so I guess you're just supposed to like go like this. I'm excited. This is <laughs> this is actually what the reason why I like purchased from Charlotte Tilbury because they saw these, saw they're the new rave. It's like okay, hook me up. I want to try it, and then I just happened to purchase more things. It's weird how these things end up in your cart when you go to purchase a couple things. Okay, so th this one is the highlight. Blush. Um, what color is this? I kind of forgot. Peach Gasm. So again, 
I'm so excited. The only thing I forgot to buy was a beauty blender, but we're just gonna make everything work. So I'm gonna start with primers. I don't usually use primers, but occasionally. Or for the sake of a video, why not? Okay, so I am using Vers Versert. I got this in like a boxy charm a while ago. So I'm just putting that on my eyelids. I do like this one. And then I also am going to use Do Not Age. If you can see that. How does it focus? Okay, we're just gonna hope that focuses, but it's Do Not Age Triple Peptide Eye Cream. This is for dark circles, and as you can see, my age is showing. <laughs> so I'm just gonna put a little amount underneath my eyes. And kind of pretend that we're not getting older. You feel me? You feel me? Okay. Like so. I just bought this Grande, Grande Lash MD um, from Ulta and I've been trying to put it on my eyelid or on my lash line to grow my eyelashes. My eyelashes are not long. I got eyelash extensions a minute ago, therefore they've been just not growing. They've been compromised, if you would. And I'd really love to not have to wear uh, false lashes every day. I just love the look of big lashes. And if one day I can get there, that's good enough for me. Okay. Got that in. I usually like wait a second for this to like dry. I'm gonna drink my water. If you haven't drank water, this is your reminder to go do so. I'm going to add this foundation. Okay, she's kind of dark, but that's okay because we have to match the rest of my body. Do any of you guys have a darker forehead than the rest of your like face? It honestly drives me crazy, but I'm gonna do this and then I'm gonna blend it all in. I really wish I had a beauty blender right now. I feel like that would really help evening this out. I added a little bit more just for some better coverage. I'm gonna go in with my NARS Creamy Concealer and I'm just gonna go under my eye. This shade is in Ginger. So I'm just gonna go under and then up like this. And then I'm just going to blend this in. That worked so well. I'm honestly shook. I don't use concealer ever, but I have to. I'm going to be going in with the contour wand for the contour. And I'm just going to... I'm gonna go kind of high on our cheekbones. Okay, and then I'm just gonna blend all of this out. I'm actually obsessed with how natural that looks. I feel like that blended so nicely. Next, I'm gonna go in with the blush from Charlotte Tilbury in the shade Peach Gasm on the apples of my cheeks. 
and then a little bit on my nose. Like so. I feel like I kind of want a little bit more. And then just blend that out. Next, I'm gonna be going in with the Laura Mercier setting powder. And I'm just gonna put it under my eyes to set. This is when a beauty blender would go in clutch. And tell me why I don't have one. Next, I'm gonna be going in with the Charlotte Tilbury to cover the rest of my face. I realize I need new brushes. Oh wow, that is very powdery. I'm gonna be getting my Hoola Benefit bronzer and just kinda like blend out what I've already contoured. Kind of shook by how good my makeup already looks. Everything's blended so nicely. I'm just gonna be going in with the telescopic L'Oreal Black Mascara. It says to prime your eyes first with this voluminous primer. I've never used this, but we shall see. So after priming my eyes, gonna be going finally in with the mascara and just black I feel like I look so like youthful I love it Lastly is lips and I'm using the MAC lip pencil and spice Now I'm just going to be adding a shiny lip gloss. I don't have my favorite one that I usually put on. Um, that's from Pillow Plump. This is too dark of a color, so I'm just using regular plump lip gloss. And that is the look. Look very natural, but ready for photo shoot. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna be also sharing what I got from Shein, and then I'll probably do a try on. For Shein, I only got a couple things because I'm trying to budget, believe it or not. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I wanted to buy this for a while, but I just kept on stalling. But it's a set, it's this pretty like mint color. So that's the top, and then it also came with these cute little shorts, like. How cute, I love it. I'll try that one. And then this top. Who is she? That is adorable, you guys, I don't know if you can tell, but there's like chain that ties it together. This is gonna look really cute for like a night out if you're feeling spunky. And then, okay, the last one is kind of gonna be funny. Because I literally bought this it's just so I could decorate my Christmas tree. And so off. But I think it's super adorbs for the holidays. Are you guys ready? Drum roll, please. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is the top and the bottoms. Okay. I can't wait. I'll probably do a live on either TikTok or Instagram when I decorate my tree. Okay guys, I absolutely love this set. Like, the top has some padding in it, um, and I'll probably take that out. And then the bottoms. It just looks so cute. Just like, 
I'm lounging around the house wearing this. Okay, since the holidays are among us, I figured I would wrap up this video in something festive. <laughs> if you watch this whole video, thank you. It really does mean a lot to me. Make sure you subscribe, follow me on Instagram. Everything will be linked in the bio. I just appreciate you guys so much. This really means a lot to me, especially since I'm a new creator. Like I keep saying, it's only gonna get better from here. <laughs>